All right, so really cool new feature that you can do. It's this thing called attribute. And in the attribute, there's an attribute that affects the size of entities now. So if I flick this lever right here, it'll be like, boom. And, <laughs> and then we got a massive iron golem. And I want to make this work on like every mob in the game. It's going to be actually a nice touch because like if you're playing vanilla and stuff and you come across like a horse or something and it's like really big or like really tiny, it would be kind of cool actually. And it's going to be a little interesting to do this. Villager, you looked at me funny. You're going to get shrunk. Yeah, yeah, that's what you get. Don't ever look at me like that again, little buddy. I'm going to step on you and squash you if you keep running around like that. No, we're not doing that. I was going to make it to where if like if something was too small and you stepped on it, it would get squashed. But no, that's that's another video. All right. So let's get started on the actual sauce of the video where we make it to where mobs kind of randomly have a chance to get like a random scale that they're going to do. And the way we're going to do that is there's a new random command. We're going to have to make a list of every mob that we want to get affected. We can't just like apply it to everything because that would do it to like arrows. It would do it to items. It would do it to experience. And we don't want that. Oh, <laughs> what are you doing, little guy? Are you coming over to help me with my commands? All right, here, I'll get you a little command block you can work with. There you go, buddy. I don't even know who you are. So first two command blocks are set up. We're going to be having the first one do a thing basically saying this entity that we want to change the scale of has spawned. And then the second one says if this is an entity that has spawned, it's going to roll a random value between 1 to 1,000. Whatever number they get, like the Iron Golem right here, you, that number is going to determine the scale of it. All right, so I've made a few adjustments to the scaling system we're going to use. We're actually going to copy the system that they use in Pokemon. So there's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 different scales they can be. Going from extra, extra small to extra, extra, wait, extra, extra, extra small to extra, extra small to extra, small, small, medium, large, extra, large, extra, large. Extra, extra, extra large. The max they can roll is a 255, and the lowest they can roll is a zero. You have to roll exactly a 255 to get extra, extra, extra large, and you have to roll exactly a zero to get extra, extra, extra small. Those are going to be the rarest. I'm going to have something special and super cool for them. All right, so that should do it. If we spawn in a new iron golem, he spawned and he got the tag large. So that would be a large iron golem. Now we just need to make it to where he is scaled to being large. I think the max should be double the size. I think that would make the most sense. Okay, wait, did that work? Wait, so we spawn one. Oh, that's an extra large iron golem. Okay. <laughs> oh, extra large. This, this one's, oh, this one's a small one. Oh, that's so cool. So it's already working. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. I want to get like a an, uh, an extra, extra small or an extra large one. Okay, so the rarity is working out. I haven't gotten an extra, extra large or an extra, extra small yet. Am I just really unlucky or did I do something wrong? Because I have spawned... <laughs> so many of these and I'm not getting the biggest one. Oh wait, an extra extra large. There's one. Look at that. That guy's huge. Oh my gosh. All right. I want to add some more. Uh, let's get rid of all these iron golems. All right. Let's do it on some wolves. Oh, that's a fat wolf. Oh my gosh. An extra large wolf. Extra extra large. Okay. Large. Extra large. Extra extra large. Medium medium. Oh, that's so cool. There's a lot of extra large wolves. I want like, oh, an extra, extra large wolf. Okay, that's so cool. Wait, I want to add one command block really quick. All right, so I added it to now whenever you have an extra large one or an extra, extra, extra large one, like the max size one, it gets these special like shiny particles for being like super rare. Dude, this guy's so small. There's a smaller wolf than that. Oh, wait, does it work on babies? Is that a baby one? It does work on babies. What the heck? The babies are different. Look how tiny this one is. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, there's one right there. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's so tiny. <laughs> What's up, little dude? How's it going? Oh, there's, and that's a regular sized wolf. So that's a tiny wolf. And he's got the blue particles. Look how cute he is. <laughs> we got a little tiny horse. Wait, saddle? Can we, is it possible? No. <laughs> saddle. You're mine. <laughs> that is, <laughs> so even the mobs that are like super tiny and adjusted and scaled still work perfectly. And we can just add this to every single creature. All right, so I got to start the excruciating process of adding every every single mob that I want to add. That's going to change scale. All right, so I got a little distracted. I got a little I got a little distracted. And I wanted to add a thing that tells you whenever like one of the rare sizes spawns. So let's see if I can get it to do its thing. Oh wait, it said tiny in chat. A tiny creature has spawned. Where is he? That's not tiny. Is that a baby? Oh, I see the particles. It's this guy. What's up, dude? 
Oh, a tiny swan. There he is. I saw him. There he is. I think this one's a tiny baby. Look, at <laughs> Look how tiny he is. Oh, a giant. We got a giant to spawn. That is, this is a huge horse. All right, I need to not get distracted. I'm converting everything to a data pack right now. So by the way, if you want to get the data pack, it will be in the description. All the, all the stuff, it's going to be there. If you want to play this and add it to your world, it's going to be super seamless, super cool. You just got to throw it in. Data pack's ready. Let's see if it works in a random world. Okay. I think I added all of the passive mobs. So I hope, oh, a giant creature has spawned. A tiny creature has spawned. Okay, maybe this, the chat message might be a little much, but we're gonna keep it for now. Okay, wait, this should be the tiny one. Oh, it's a tiny pig. What's up, dude? <laughs> You're so cute. All right, wait, which one was the really big one that spawned? It's up here, it's a rabbit. It's a massive, oh my God, it's a massive evil rabbit, dude. You can, okay, take it all, take it all. I don't need it, I don't need it. Take it all, it's all yours. Bye-bye, just leave me alone. Tiny cow. <laughs> All right, this is the best data pack I've ever made. The rates are a little high, at least to be having a message appear for every single one. So I'll probably turn the message off in the data pack. All right, cool. All that's left to do is to get the reactions to see if people think this is a valid data pack or not. I think it's pretty sweet. Like usually I kind of mess around with people with data packs that I make, but this one I was like, you know what? This would actually be a really cool feature to add to the game. So here we are, the feature is added to the game. No way, a giant salmon. That is so weird. What, what exactly is this data pack? Oh, Why are there so many food? pumpkins? Oh! oh, what? Go stand by that sheep, bro. <laughs> yo, yo, why is he so tall? Oh, this is, see, this is a, this is a sheep that's just a little bigger than the other one. Look at this guy. He's a little a smaller. A little bigger? Part of the data pack. How are they just giants? A tiny creature is spawned. We gotta go look for him. But Quiff is already here. Just you wait. Just you wait. <laughs> Okay, whoa, 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 friendly fire! Tiny creatures. Wait, tiny? Where? Well, yeah, where are they spawning? Guys, is what? no one gonna question how Yo, tiny this pig is? This pig. <gasps> Wait, is this a tiny one that's spawning? He's, Dude, they're so rare, don't too. Don't kill it. What is, don't, he just said it's rare. Why are you stabbing it if it's rare? Yeah, Because no. he needs to die. Are there like shiny ones that spawn? Is this Pokemon? So there's a chance for them to be super, super tiny. And there's a chance for them to be super, super big. And those are the rarest ones. AKA the one that Quiff just killed. Nice. Nice going, buddy. It we could, happens. We could have saved happens. that I thing. misclicked. I misclicked. What happens if you breed a big one with a tiny one? Uh, that, that uh, I don't get paid enough for that. Uh, yo, those skeletons look tall. And I'm not ready for that. Yeah. Oh, wait. It's, is that it? I think there's a spider down there. That's it. I it's a tiny, a tiny spider. spider. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's blue particles. Oh, yeah. He's That's so tiny. Me. Look how cute he is. die. Oh, wait. Don't kill him. He's real life spider size. He's so small. <gasps> this spider's massive. I, I prefer oh, the smaller ones. Oh, my gosh. Ones. Yo, it's the new armadillos. <gasps> wait, Yo, I actually what? haven't seen one of these yet. Yo, they look They're so, so ugly. Cool. Oh, wait. Is, look at this one. It's It's got the red particles. Wait, does that mean he's a giant? Yo, wait. Look at the size comparison. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I need to make a volleyball data pack with armadillos. Okay. Yeah, so I'm every single mob hostage. in the game can change in size. Uh, why are you spawning giant creepers? What is this? Oh, what the what is going on? Here, let's see if it works on the warden. Uh, oh my. The wardens are super tiny. Oh, warden? look, it's a, <laughs> I just spawned an actually tiny one. What do you think on the state pack? You think it's a think it's a good feature? Think it should be in Minecraft normally? Yeah, I'd love that. I would just like a way to capture them, you know, and so I could call them and force them to do things at any time. I like it, but I'm also scared of the giant mobs. Giant creepers are not, are not it. 